Oi. I have finally, hopefully, got some mods to work. I have no clue which of them I got to work. That thing ain't the mod. That should be a mod. Wait. Damn it. What was the button again? This one. Yay! Oh god. Dying Light one. Right now, free to download on the Epic Store. There are some mods I know I got to work. Which is the reshade mod and the save file, which is a full save file. Also, Super Chump should be on. But anything else. This isn't tot. Well, no full damage ain't working. Oopsie. Thanks for the tips. Oh, God. No clue what works with this mod. No clue. Super chump seems to work. So that makes me jump a little bit higher. Which was kick again. F. E. Damn, I never played this game. One. E, right? E. Maybe super drop kick works. Let's see. I feel like it doesn't work at all because Super Chump is just ruining it. Yeah. 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 Yeah, no clue. No clue. Is my flashlight mod working now? Nope. Beforehand it worked. It was red beforehand. Damn it. Damn it, game. Yeah, it's one of the games where you just don't know which mods got activated and which nah, did not get activated. <laughs> it doesn't quite look right. Unlimited grappling hook, maybe. That seems like it works. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Still safe way down there. Doesn't matter. Look at that. Okay. Okay, we're going somewhere. That seems to work. Forehead super sprint. I feel like you can only use one of the super mods. Nope. It's not up here. Yeah. I'm going to show you in a second the reshade mod with comparisons. Also right here is a nice spot where I can maybe show it. Damn it. And then I'm going to show you the mods that I know worked and the Epic Store side. But I've been messing around for one hour and I don't want to mess around anymore. The grappling hook at least. That at least works. Okay, reshade real quick. In here or out here. That's the reshade. Photorealistic. Gets rid of the weird filters. And that's how the game looks like without that reshade. Just look at that comparison. The reshade looks so clean and nice. Oh, which one? Dying light. And back again with the reshade. So goddamn clean and nice. Definitely needed. All the other mods. Beh. Yeah, super drop kick doesn't seem to work. At least the infinite grappling hook does work. Yeah, that's a winner. Whoop. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. Out of here. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Let's do a quick reshade test. That's the reshade I've selected for this game. Makes everything clearer, just as a comparison. That's how the game looks like, actually. 
Oh, damn, that's a big goddamn difference. Look at how clean this is looking. Also, more mods to comparison. Okay, maybe not this one. What's a good one? Decay. Decay is a good one. Yeah, nah, nah. It definitely needs this one. That's so goddamn clean. Damn, this is clean. Okay, now I need to load the next finished game. As you can see here, Dying Light 1, the enhanced edition, is free right now. Its cost and loss means now free for this week, 13 April, or uh, till the 13th April, and then you get other games. Second Extinction Early Access also sounds interesting. That's the dinosaur shooter for next week. For like a saw a little bit of gameplay for that. That doesn't seem too bad. I'm gonna try that next week. But yeah, Dying Light right now, the first game with all its DLCs. You can have that right here, right now. Two add-ons. I actually never I played it on the PS3, I believe. But I never quite finished it because I played with a friend. It was a co-op game. And he kind of screwed me over with playing for the campaign and just skipped the hat and played alone without me. So I got about 70% of the campaign and never quite finished it. There I have a bunch of mods. Not everything seems to work and some things just override each other. So, which mods? That's the reshade. I can recommend this one. This looks dope as hell. That's the reshade mod. The grappling hook mod also seems to work. It just lets you grapple easier. First of all, you need to have that unlocked yet. Overgrowth. No clue if that worked or not. <laughs> I mean, look at that comparison. How the hell should I realize that? I don't know the game in and out. But if you want more bushes, if you're a bush fan, there you go. The flashlight seemed to work once off recording. The red one, I got that to work. When I now record it, I seem to have lost my flashlight. Hey, Stinveg, that's the guy who made the Dead Space mods. Yeah, yeah, holy hell. I just realized that Stinveg, how do I get to this? Right, Mr. Dead Space Mods. Gotta check it, gotta check it. Can't help myself. No? Hmm. 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 Maybe not, maybe not, maybe I'm tripping. Superpowers is super jump, which lets you jump a little bit more. And the super sprint is something you had beforehand. I feel like you can't mash them. And I downloaded everything with Vortex. Maybe it's better if you manually download everything. And then the save file, which took me a long time to work, get to work. You can't do that with Vortex. It does not work with Vortex. I've tried that before. And here's a quick example on where to find that, where to find your saved games. So first of all, you need to... Create a safe file by starting the campaign if you want one of the safe file mods. And then what you need to do, what helped move me with Epics, was type in save. Then you have that a safe file, dying light, which was under documents here, not where the packs folders are. And then I replaced save coop with this one. So I overwrite it, this safe file. After I started, I can download that real quick for you and show you that. Oops, manual download. That might be the most fun thing if you want to directly jump into the game. There are different versions of that. Let's download that. Then I have it here. Extract with 7-zip or Vinra. And you get this one and I needed to change the one with a zero umbilanan zero 
and then drag that over the other file the safe file here and then it overwrite itself so like that the time till it sets in you got this and then when you start up the game you normally get a message too and then you need to click the left side local data you need to click local data and then you get the new save okay that i'm breaking i'm gonna delete it i have enough of dying light i don't need it i just want to show it off real quick yeah yeah also i have a dying light two dropkick montage that i'm gonna link here but that's it it's free right now go check it out if you haven't played it it's a pretty cool and decent zombie game but yeah peace out thanks for watching leave a like one hour of morning struggles and i don't quite know ah there were a few mods who didn't work but i don't quite know what worked exactly how it should ha yeah <laughs> Oh, that's hot. That's hot.